Hey, this is Daniel from Adorama. We're setting up to shoot some portraits of all the store staff for the brand new website we're launching, adorama.nyc, and I'm gonna show you how we're doing it. So I've got Gene here on set, and we've got him lit with a Ellen Chrome 28 inch Rotolux for his key light. On the background, I've got a grid uh, giving a streak of light across the back, and on the lens, I've got a ring flash. I'm gonna use this as fill, but first I wanna show you why and how I'm gonna do this. So if we take Gene here with the ring flash turned off, and you can look off this way. And make a photo of them. This is exactly the way I want it. Kind of dark and shadowy. But whenever you're doing some kind of corporate assignment, you wanna make sure that you have some room to move. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add the ring flash into the front to flatten out my shadows, and then I'm gonna use my software here, Capture One, to bring them back. That way I have both options for the client. So I'm just gonna turn this on. This is a Ranger Quadra. Okay, so that's fired up, and we're gonna take a shot. Good, here we go. So you can see now that, compared to the first shot, this is much, much flatter. Now, by going into Capture One, I can just grab my profile here, and I can pull it over to bring my shadows back in and give myself some, the dark mood that I had in the original shot, or similar to it, but with a lot more control. So here I have all the, the room in the room, world to move. Here, I'm basically, my shadows are blocked up where, where permanently and I can't bring that back necessarily. Here I've got a nice warm feel as well because of the white balance. The one other thing we're gonna do is just lower the saturation. And what's great about shooting into capture software like this is once I make these changes on the first image, they're gonna stay for all the rest. So I get this look in the way I want and then we'll just shoot a few, do a few more shots to get the right personality out of Gene. What's nice about using an on-camera fill, like a ring flash, is that no matter where they put their face, they're always gonna get a little bit of catch light in their eyes. So even if their face is partially in shadow, it'll still give them that little snap. So thanks for watching. Be sure to check out our new adorama.nyc website. Whether you live in New York or you're traveling here, you just want to see what's going on in the store, there's always things happening here. So check us out, adorama.nyc, and I'll see you next time.